Hey guys, it's me again. Um, I just wanted to give you a, a quick video on, you know, how to clean out your Baby Lock Alliance uh, bobbin area. So, mine's pretty linty. I do a lot of embroidery work. Um, so, you just remove your bobbin case. And, you know, you just try to get the dust out. I've been told, you know, never try to use those... Uh, those, I don't know what they're called, like they're like cans of spray of air. Don't use those. They said, you know, that will get it uh, stuck into the machine further. So I've been told not to use those. What you can also use is a micro vacuum. I personally never used one. I just buy, you know, different types of lint brushes and use those, you know, but try to get it all out. My husband is better at this than I am. He's a, a kind of a clean freak when it comes to this machine, you know. He, of course, he wants to take care of it. Um, so I just, you know, try to get as much lint out as possible, um, you know, because it does build up quite a lot, especially if you're doing like T-shirts, the cotton, you know, there's a lot, a lot of lint that comes out of it. I know I'm not the best at cleaning this, but I try. And you know, if you don't do this, you, you know, you may have some issues with your bobbin, um, check bobbin thread, it might say, you know, because the thread might get stuck if you don't clean this out, you know, you want to keep this clean, you know, this machine costs a good, a good, a little good amount of money, so, you know, you want to keep it clean, um, oil it every day before you use it, I mean, unless you just don't use it that often, I use it a lot, I make maybe 10 to 15 shirts a day, on it uh, so I use it a lot um, you just want to you know keep it clean as much as possible um, also you know every once in a while I do unscrew this and take the dust out of here as well you know you don't want anything getting in the way of your needle damaging your needle and stuff also when the needle comes down sometimes you notice that it's dusty up there my husband loves to clean that out so I just let him do that that's his favorite part um, so I just try to clean it out of all the nooks and crannies, you know, um, when you oil it, you have to turn the knob in the back and this will come around and you drop oil, it'll be like right here, you know, that's, you know, to keep the machine, uh, fresh, you know, no issues, no squeaking, you know, just try to keep your machine as clean as possible. Um, that's just the best, that's how you, you know keep up with it and you know you won't have any major issues now if you don't clean your machine you know you may run into some issues and you, we both don't want that you know alrighty and when you're done put your bobbin back in and push it till it clicks push this up and close it and you are all done thank you guys